To get things started, I imported a background image and a YouTube image to my project. Let's begin by dragging our background image onto our first track, and then our other image onto our second track. Now, I'm just going to double click on my YouTube image to select it so I can resize it. While holding down the Shift key, drag one of the corner handles to resize the image. Let's also drag it up a little bit to make room for our reflection. Okay, now let's duplicate our YouTube image for our reflection effect. Back on the timeline, hold down the Alt key while dragging your image up to the next track. Now we need some effects to make it look more like a reflection. Head over to the Effects pane and type Vertical Flip in the search box. Drag the effect onto your duplicated image. The next effect we need is Linear Wipe, so do a search for that and then drag it onto your duplicated image. The last effect we need to search for is Gaussian Blur, so find that and drag it onto your image as well. Now with all our effects in place, we're going to go up to the Effect Controls pane for our duplicated image. Change the image's position so that it's just underneath your main image. Then, under Linear Wipe, I'm going to increase my transition completion to around 50%. I'm going to set my wipe angle to 0 degrees. And let's increase the feather property to 300. The last thing we need to do is adjust the Gaussian Blur. I'm going to increase mine to 13. Alright, and there you have it. You now know how to make a reflection effect in Premiere Pro.